Singaporeans are set to vote on September 1st for the presidential election, but this will only happen if more than one candidate qualifies to run for the presidency. The decision on whether there will be an election or a walkover will be made known on nomination day on August 22nd. The dates were announced on the Government Gazette website on Friday, August 11th, confirming that Prime Minister Lee Shin Long has initiated the election process by issuing the writ of election. Before nomination day, the Presidential Elections Committee will evaluate all potential candidates and communicate their decision to them. If there is only a single eligible candidate, that individual will be declared the president on nomination day. Polling day will be designated as a public holiday. Currently, there are four individuals who have expressed their intention to run for president, former senior minister Thaman Shanmugaram, age 66, George Goh, a 63-year-old entrepreneur, in Kok Song, a former GIC investment chief, age 75, and Tan Kim Lian, the former NTUC income chief, also age 75. The incumbent president Halima Yoko has confirmed that she will not be seeking re-election. In terms of candidacy timelines, Thaman launched his presidential bid on July 26, while George Goh submitted his forms on August 4, and In Kok Song did so on the same week. Tan Kim Lian officially launched his presidential bid on Friday. In light of the upcoming presidential election in 2023 and the associated read of election, the Ministry of Education MOE and the Singapore Examinations and Assessment Board SCABE have implemented several adjustments to the academic schedule. In a joint media release on Friday, MOE and SCABE said the school holiday originally planned for Teachers' Day 2023 on September 1st has been rescheduled. Instead, it will now take place on September 11th, which will be designated a school holiday. The GCN level papers originally scheduled for September 11th Monday will now be conducted on the 12th and the 20th of September.